The following portion of the Arizona Daily Mix is sponsored by Camelback Subaru. Well, hi, and welcome to another one of Wally's Weekend Drives. And man, I'll tell you, it's one of Wally's great weekend drives it today. Because we're up here at Camelback Subaru, talking to Burt Myers here, Mr. Subaru. Thanks, right here. Wally. Good there. to see you, man. Yeah, good to good see you, man. I'll tell you what, I'm excited for this new 2025. Five. Yes, yeah, the Forester right there for sure. Now, if you look at it, like you said, what, what changes were made? Look, look at, at the car, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a lot of changes were made here. Uh, the styling for sure, taste for sure. Mechanics for sure. Yeah. I mean, everything changed on this. So let's go ahead and let's start up front here. Uh, right up front, the first thing you're going to notice much sleeker in the front. Much sleeker in the yeah. front. Again, plenty of vents getting to that engine that's in there. Again, a 2.5 liter boxer motor there. Uh, Subaru's mainstay right there. there you along go. with that symmetrical all wheel drive that's right behind it. Yep. But there's a change in the CVT, right? Yeah, we added a gear. Yeah, that's right. Okay, better, a little bit better, better mileage in too. Right? Yeah, absolutely. Yes, okay, so we're, we're looking at that. Now, that two and a half uh, liter. Uh, boxer motor in there making 180 horse and 178 foot pounds of torque basically what I call a square motor uh, yep. you know making the same horsepower and torque that is going to give you reliability off-road and very linear uh, yep. acceleration off-road okay so working away around to the side here one thing that we notice here again the styling you know very nice you know, fender trim right here, and you see now they've added, again, it's all about aerodynamics and mileage here. We've added air curtains in here now to route that wind as it comes out and get it away and create less drag. And if you look down in here, 19 inch, it's bronze, right? Yep, and of course, you know, you saw the rooms out. Even the rooms are designed to help for aerodynamics. That's right, that's right. You see right here, the, all those little veins, it's all about making the wind move like that. And when you think about wind, it's really not that complicated, think water. Wind and water work the same way. Absolutely. So when you see water, when you say a wind tunnel or something, yeah. you see those guys in there with a little wand spraying yep. water, they're seeing where it goes. But that leads us to the inside right here. And, and one of the great things about this I really like about Subaru is the versatility of the inside, meaning the durability more than anything. And if you look right here, everything is soft on this. I'm yeah, really liking it. Nice the one thing they did move to the sport this year, it's got our StarTech interior. You know, oh, the, yes. Out of the wilderness, which means it's really designed for the people that want to go out. Remember the time we did the water test? Yes. That's right. Yes. That's the same interior now. That's right. That's right. And that's one of the things we love about Subaru is whether you've got animals in your car or you are an animal yourself and you're out camping. Well, that covers you. Yeah, that's right. That's right. You've never seen a vehicle after I get done camping. <laughs> uh, in, in fact, it usually takes about an hour or two to uh, clean, clean it, it up. Out. Yes, yes. But that's all good right there. So you, know, you got the tilt telescopic smart steering wheel right there. Got all your controls right at your fingertips. You got the big display. You're rocking down the road. You got a giant panoramic moonroof oh, up yeah, there. That's great. Uh, yeah, that thing. I, I felt like roast Wally under glass on the way down <laughs> here, man. It was really great. Uh, and if you look into the back, Subaru didn't forget about the people in the back either because you do see the USB and USB C outlets back there, along with vents. Uh, vents are very important when it's over 110 degrees here in Phoenix, yep. the people in the back need to be cool too, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yes. Okay, Great so way. let's walk around to the back here because, again, styling. I mean, we look at this thing. This is just very, very clean. Uh, I really like what it is. And maybe it's the crystal white pearl paint job that's on here that yeah. makes it look that clean, but it just looks pristine. You know, uh, and if you look in here, you want to keep your Subaru pristine. The first thing you're going to want to do is get one of these mats. Do these come with it? This comes with the Sport model. That's yes, it right. Does. It comes with the Sport model, and it's labeled right here as a Forester, so you can see that too. And if you look underneath, way underneath, I think you're going to find a spare tire. Yes, there. you are. Yes, there you go. Subaru isn't going to take you off road without. A spare tire. There you go. And that's you got extra storage. That's right. So MSRP on this bird is thirty-seven thousand five hundred and ninety dollars. Now it is a twenty twenty-five. Yep. Um, so are there any kind of like incentives going on yet, or have they, have they really caught up no, to the fact? No. Here's what we're doing. You know, Wally, it's a it's a different world from it was three or four years ago. Right. So you know what? First of all, we got models that are a little bit less, a little bit more in this Forster line, but we are being very aggressive right now. Good. So yeah, you come on down, and our guys want to make you a deal that's going to get you into a new Subaru. That's important to know. That, that's right. And Bert's the guy to see when you come down here to Camelback Subaru. So make sure 
up to 51 to the Camelback Road. You're right off the, the 51 here on Camelback. Easy to find, can't miss it for sure. Burt Myers, Camelback Subaru, come on up here. Check this thing out, man, because I'll tell you what, I like it. The preceding portion of the Arizona Daily Mix was sponsored by Camelback Subaru.